As Zimbabweans are still keenly waiting for the SADC leaders to discuss the Observer Mission's scathing reports on the recent elections, President Ramaphosa says the regional bloc is yet to receive the comprehensive report. What uh, was said by a representative of the Observer Mission uh, is still got to be discussed in SADC because it's not a final report. And if one looks at that report, it actually says there were challenges, challenges with regard to a number of things that have to do with elections. And nearly every, many countries around the world have such challenges. The United States is, you know, a prime example uh, with regard to their last election. So there are challenges, and they have said in the report, as I read it, that certain things need to be improved. Ramaphosa has also indicated that the Observer Mission report did not nullify the recent elections. The president met with his Zimbabwean counterpart, President Emerson Nangagwa, on the sidelines of the United Nations General Assembly in New York. Where there's a lack of transparency, we need, they need to come up with the details. And I would say, yes, let the details be put forward so that we can deal with them. So we are waiting to receive that report at the SADC level so that we can deal with it. Because it, if anything, it was an interim report. So once the report is put to the SADC body, we will then debate it. And we will also hear representations from Zimbabwe as well as from the Observer Mission as well. The SADC Observer Mission head in Zimbabwe says they never sought to interfere with the electoral laws in Harare. We are not interfering with the laws of any country. It is within the guidelines. It is within, and we didn't say change this law or change that law. We just you know, outlined laws on delimitation, and there was delimitation, and it was a point of, uh, uh, of conflict. Uh, the, you know, the ballot papers, when they should be released through transparency, we had to go back to the constitution of Zimbabwe to see what it says. It talks about transparency. And we noticed that the other laws that were enacted to block that transparency, we didn't tell them what to do with that law, but we are mandated to point it out that this law stands in the way of a democratic process and it could actually affect the outcome or the uh, legitimacy of the, the outcome of the election. Kyle Kumalo, SABC News, Johannesburg.